hi there welcome to my channel um it's been a while since i've uploaded a video uh, but yeah my life has been super busy lately and i haven't had time to edit a video so yeah anyway i wanted to share a vid a uh, diy that the kids and i worked on this summer um, this is a cabinet that my sister bought for us at a yard sale i was originally looking for a cabinet of uh, to use for my little girl's clothes but I decided to use this cabinet for something else. Anyway, we started uh, by cleaning the cabinet to get it ready for sanding. And um, once that was done, we started sanding the, the top of the dresser. My little boy helped me. I sand some of it and my brother uh, came over to help me sand the rest of the cabinet. My little lady, as you can see here, uh, helped me take the knobs off the cabinet drawers um, and she did a pretty good job. Once the dresser was sanded, I sprayed it with a primer, which I didn't need to do because the paint that I bought has a primer and a finish all in, um, in it already. So it was a waste of time. And also the, the spray left a, a weird texture on top of the dresser and I had to sand it down and um, clean it up. So. Yeah, it was a waste of time. The paint that I decided to use is called Country Chic All-in-One. And at first, I really didn't believe that it had everything in one. And the and plus, the little tub is super small. And I didn't um, think I was going to have enough for the whole thing. But I actually had some left over. It goes on really thick. Um, you can dilute this if you have a spray gun. I wish I had one, but I don't. I don't have any experience with painting furniture, so this was um, a new thing for me. And I'm glad that I bought this paint. Um, it turned out um, to work out for us pretty well. And also, my little girl did a good job painting the drawers. And um, the color that we picked is like a light blush color, and um, I wanted a light color because. I wanted a drastic change from the black, the original black color on the cabinet. Once the paint was dried, um, I sprayed it with a finish. And I'm going to be honest, I don't like how it looks with the finish. I like how it looked after it was uh, painted and the paint had dried. Um, and I made the mistake of spraying it with a finish thinking that I was going to make it look better. I still like the way it looks, but um, I wish I would have left it alone. <laughs> so please don't waste your money. If you're going to be using this paint, don't buy primer and don't buy a finish. You don't need it. Anyway, like I said before, the hardest part about this um, project was um, waiting for the paint to dry um, because I really want to put these little knobs on there. I bought these knobs or, or pools, I guess, drawer pools from Amazon for about $3. And um, I like the way it looks. I think um, it brings the look of it, like it makes it look a little bit more cleaned up. Um, and after I added these drawer pools, I, um, I put this vintage mirror on top of it with this little vintage um, lamp to dress it up. And I think it looks so cute. It looks really adorable. I'm using this cabinet as a linen cabinet. And yeah, I'm really happy how it turns out, how it turned out at the end. But anyway, I hope you like this video and thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and um, visit me again. I'm going to try to upload another video soon. Have a great day. Bye.